Hi guys! In this video you'll see how the actors of the movie Boys in the Hood 1991 have changed. You'll know their real names and age. I will show you how they look then and what's with them now in 2023. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Let's go! Ricky Baker is distinguished by a responsible attitude both in terms of his personal life and in general the future. He is not used to shifting his duties to others is not conflicted and is not used to hiding his feelings. The role is played by Morris Chestnut. Riva Stiles was previously married to Furious, by whom she gave birth to Trey. She can be stern, doesn't like people prying, and to stick to agreements, which she demands from others as well. She knows how to manage her time clearly. Cowboy Ice Cube doesn't infrequently make abusive comments even to his friends and can boast of the number of girls he has had. He has a hard time getting on the righteous path, cannot stop in time and can be revengeful if someone harms his loved ones. Trey Styles doesn't try to take the path of least resistance and be like a lot of guys in the southern district. He can be persistent, tries to be polite with girls and is not prone to betrayal. Not used to leaving friends to their fate. Played by Cuba Gooding Jr. Furious Styles is closely related to Trey and cares about Sun. He leads a very measured life and is not particularly ambitious. However, he is not naive, has a good reaction and is not afraid to stand up for himself. The role is played by Larry Fishburne. Mad Dog often hangs out in the area with Rick Rock. He has developed good dexterity and is generally used to remaining unemotional in many situations, but still tends to be understanding. Played by Lexi Beham, who died in a car accident in 1995. Louis Crump is an employee at the University of California who visited Ricky Baker for a more detailed profile of a potential student. He is distinguished by politeness and adheres to moral standards, has a balanced character. He was played by John Cawthron Jr. Mrs. Baker, Tyra Farrell, is in charge of raising Ricky and Doughboy, but has been unable to cope with the latter. She can be grumpy, is not accustomed to hiding her discontent and doesn't want to do only raising children, even if they are her grandchildren. Knucklehead number 2 has a somewhat violent nature and has chosen the path of a gangster. Can be violent for no really good reason, just for fun and can even kill a man if someone verbally offends his friends. Played by Lloyd Avery II, who was killed in 2005. Chris Reg Green is one of Dowboy's loyal buddies. Although he's chained to a wheelchair, he is the soul of the company, is active and will even support his friends when it's necessary to teach the scoundrel a lesson. Ice Cream Truck Kid is not trying to prove anything to anyone, has a rather unflappable nature and is not used to getting annoyed over trifles. He likes to spend time actively and knows how to communicate well with his peers. He was played by Karen J. Grimes. Doki is part of the Dowboy company. He is not one of those who lead a diligent life, as life in the southern quarter has had a detrimental effect on him. Has a somewhat childlike mindset, played by Dedrick D. Gobert, who died of a gunshot wound in 1994. Bobby, aged 10, goes to the same school as Trey. He has no modesty and tries to show that he is fearless and not afraid of getting shot. He doesn't have a special craving for knowledge and is able to intrigue his classmates. Played by Valentina Harrison. Trey, aged 10, is a diligent student who doesn't condone classmates and is able to defend his opinion because of which he can get into an argument with other children or even fight. Sometimes can verbally offend. The role is played by Daisy Arnes Hines 2. 
Doughboy, age 10, lives near Furious and is friends with Trey. He is not particularly eager to give pro bono help and even for money doesn't always agree if he is not satisfied with the payment. Not accustomed to responsibility, played by Baha Jackson. Shalika, Regina King, enters Chinese intimate circle. Although she often behaves cheekily, she doesn't allow others to address her impolitely. She is not inclined to experience discontent and other emotions within herself and splashes it out on others. Brandy is in a romantic relationship with Tre. She is distinguished by principles and adheres to certain religious customs. Brandy loves when a guy shows attention to her, able to find compromises in the current situation. The role is performed by Nia Long. Ricky, age 10, is related to Doughboy. He is more single-minded than his brother, for which he receives the approval of his mother. He goes everywhere with his saucer ball, can stand up for himself properly. The role is performed by Donovan McCrary. Shani started a family with Ricky and also has a good relationship with his mother. She is not impotent and prefers to have a trusting relationship with her lover, has a sensual nature and manifests itself as a caring mother, played by Alicia M. Rogers. Tisha's grandmother is a conscientious woman who is not connected with crime and she really cares about the fate of other people. She is quick-witted and can react somewhat sharply to a situation, played by Esther Scott, who died of a heart attack in 2020. Rick Rock, want a sweet, also like Ricky, lives in the southern district. He may well be demanding, especially of those younger than him, and is not particularly compassionate to those around him. He is distinguished by his self-righteousness and rude nature. Monster is close friends with Doughboy. He is self-confident, doesn't neglect his health, and prefers to have relationship and prefers to have relationships with trusted girls. He has the same communication style as his peers and was surprised that Doughboy could read. Ferris has an affiliation with the Crenshaw Mafia. He is not interested in anything other than a criminal lifestyle and takes pleasure in intimidating people and provoking conflict. He may even participate in the murder of a person, played by Raymond D. Turner. Mailman is Doughboy's buddy, who will always support him in anything, even if he needs to kill someone, has distinguished by a stoic nature, not squeamish and can be indifferent to someone else's fate played by John Singleton, who died of a stroke in 2019. Knucklehead No. 1 is a member of the local Blackwater gang. He is used to behaving permissively and reacting extremely aggressively to any little thing, thereby trying to assert himself and show others that he should be afraid, played by Malcolm Norrington. Yo-Yo is on good terms with Shalika. She prefers not to miss parties and likes to be in the middle of the fun. Yo-Yo has a good sense of humor and well-developed facial expressions. The role is performed by Yolanda Whitaker. Female club member Mia Bell is a very balanced and outgoing person. She likes to gossip with her friends and is aware of the private lives of many of her acquaintances. Appearance plays a special role for her, which is why she takes great care of herself. Brandy, age 10, lives on the same block as Ricky with his mom. She doesn't know how to pretend, can be attentive to others, but sometimes tends to lose concentration and forgets about her duties if something interests her, played by Nicole Brown. The old man is a resident of the southern quarter. He follows the news and knows the situation. Often blamed the local youth for the fact that it's because of their actions that others suffer. Played by Whitman Mayo, who died of a heart attack in 2001. Thank you for watching.
If you like this video, please share it on social networks, like it, and of course, subscribe to the channel.